Hi, today we're going to be trying something a little bit different. This is my pretty much stock DJI Inspire 1. It has a few little additions to it. One is namely the Skysmere Stork payload deployment system. I've been using it for several months now. It's been very successful. I've been using it operationally and it works very, very well. The downside is the only ability we have is to go and carry something and then deploy it. Once it's deployed, the object is essentially lost. So recently, I purchased a uh, G10 phenolic version, what's known as the Mantis Quad. Came out a couple years ago. Now you can find these on eBay. They're about $20. This is the five inch version. As you can see, I've made a little bit of a modification here. I've added a little bit of weight. It gives it something to actually push down on, which is gonna open up the claw. It's simply a gravity operated claw. Falls underneath and then grabs what's underneath of it. What we're gonna be picking up today would be uh, common to what we see as a suspicious object, suspicious package. Could be on the side of the road, on a bridge. We don't know what it is. Uh, there's about two pounds of weight inside of the bag, so it's gonna stay where I want it. And this is just a standard carry bag. Nothing special with it, no modifications. Now one thing I have learned, this is a very precise maneuver. So one thing you do want to do, especially when you're right over top of your target, is to take your exponential, which is in your advanced settings on the general tab, is to take those down as low as possible, 0, 0.10. The reason being is you're making so small of corrections when you're directly over top of your target that anything more is gonna over control it and the hook will just be able to swing like a pendulum and it makes it very, very difficult to acquire a target. As you'll see, Typically, uh, depending on the wind, today's a little bit blustery. We have winds blowing about 10, gusting to 15, a little bit of a crosswind. If you do this, I do recommend facing into the wind. makes it a little bit easier to go and maneuver rather than a crosswind. So if you follow those tips, you'll be successful. And as you'll see some from the video, works very well. And combining the hook grabber with the Skies Amir Stork system not only allows you to deploy a payload, but also to pick up a payload and then deploy it at another location. So if we have a suspicious package, possibly an explosive or some other hazmat, we can actually pick up the package, take it to another location and drop it off there where it can be handled safely. Hope you liked the video.